What's going on guys? A Barber CVO in the building. We are here at a beautiful Sunday Easter morning. We got my boy Dave over there getting ready. Uh, we're heading out to um, Bergen Harley Davidson right across the street. There's a Wawa. We're going to meet up with, uh, with our boys for the bikes and breakfast and heading out to the market on 9W. Um, we're gonna meet a uh, psycho fanatics there, Jerry, uh, old school Jerry. So here we go. Zaman. Are you waiting for anybody or no? Just you? All right, cool. Oh. All right. Here we go. So a nice start. I hope everything goes well today. You know, the last bikes and breakfast that I went to, um, there was an accident. So hopefully everything goes well, nothing goes wrong. You know, we always pray that nothing goes wrong. But um, yeah. We're about to uh, head on Route 3. We're going to turn around and head uh, 3 West. It's been a wonderful um, winter. You know, I, uh, I've been riding a lot. I put about 3,000 miles in the past three months. Kind of cold, but you know, I did go to Florida, to Daytona. Great experience. A lot of breakdowns on my club. Um, there was a lot of uh, situations going on. You know, that's what happened. That's what happens when uh, you go with a big group and, you know, things happen. Can't expect anything, you know, to go everything right. And, um, what else, what else, what else, what else? Oh, my, uh, like I said, five minutes or ten minutes into my ride. Heading down to Daytona with my boy Ugo and G. You know, my, uh, I actually hit. A big pothole on the turnpike. Big pothole on the turnpike and um, cracked my rim. I got delayed a day because they had to order my rim. They didn't have it in stock. You know, when you have CVO rims, you know that you can't you can't keep that thing in stock. You gotta order those. But um, yeah, I was out the next day. We went to, uh, I actually rode to Florida by myself, which that was crazy. You know what I mean? Made it there safe, you know, nothing crazy, but made it there safe. That was the most important part. We got another shot of uh, American Dream right there. Here in a beautiful Jersey. Got my boy in the back, Dave. I appreciate you coming by. Make sure you follow his channel, Hudson Motor Visual. Here's Old Highway. We'll get to you when uh, we get there with the boys. All right, we're about to arrive pretty soon right now here at the Wawa. And um, I think it's Lodi. 
Lodi, New Jersey. Literally directly across the street from Harley, Bergen Harley Davidson. Like I said, we're gonna meet up with our boys, take a ride to the market. Pretty chilly today this morning. I would say 40 degrees. I mean, when you ride and everything, it's gonna be almost uh, usually it's 15 to 20 degrees, no, like 15 degrees to 20 degrees under the temperature that you're at. All depends on the speed and you go. All right, we're just taking off this exit right here. We should be uh, pulling up pretty soon. I can't wait. I haven't seen these guys in a while, you know, because of the damn winter. The damn winter holds everybody up, man. It sucks out here, man. New Jersey, you know, it's freaking still cold in April. You know, we're in springtime. But, you gotta make the best of it. Try to ride as much as you can. Meeting up with the fellas right now. At the water, there's Bergen Harley Davidson's dealership right there. I love meeting with these guys, man. These guys are cool. Cute, cute, cute. So we'll see what happens. And uh, we're going to meet up, say what's up. Maybe some subscribers are here or something like that, and uh, we'll go from there. You know what I mean? So, all right. What's up, kid? How you doing? What's up, my man? It's been like ages. <laughs> it's my boy Dave. Alright, we'll get back. I might have to fucking do that. Yeah, he's uh there's six inch drive. I mean you probably could use five to eight or eight nice. or ten. And then uh Yeah, but you, you know what it is? I'm getting sick and tired as slow. It's fucking a pain in the ass turn, it's probably super nice, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. It's like riding a motor Yeah, I was just mm -hmm. a horse beef? No, no. You can't wake up this way. Oh, come on. What's up, man? Oh, man? How you doing? Mm -hmm. hey, tell me who makes this. Uh, Thrash and Supply? Thrash and Supply. Yeah. Riser, what about the bars? Same thing. Thrash, Thrash and Supply? Yeah. So this is a how, how, how many inch? Six inch uh, straight. They come in six inch straight. Eight. What's up, man? Oh, yeah. How you doing? Oh. Good, good. Wow, you got some torque going on? I see. Uh, I, I got my heated gear. I see your boy hooked you up. <laughs> That's cool. Hello. What's up, man? How you doing? How's it going? Good. Good. What's up, buddy? How you doing? How's the uh, the new horn cover? I saw. Oh man, that thing is dope. That thing is pretty dope. Pretty dope. Getting sick and tired at slow speeds, fucking it's you know with the apes on the highway it's nice. That's a really nice setup. That's fucking beautiful. You could probably get like a low right, a little lower. I didn't uh I didn't do anything. Alright guys, we'll be back and uh we'll go from there. We got Jerry right here. Look at that. What'd you get done new here? I uh, put the new front fender clockworks. Oh nice. That's my next move. I wanna Star get one of them. Incorporated air cleaner. It looks fresh, it looks clean. New uh, speedometer. My boy G wanted that one. It comes with that little one right there, too? No, that's a thermometer. That covers oh, my. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is nice, but they don't make it from my soft tail. Yeah. 2008, I have a 2008. They said no. Is it a small one? No, it's the same, same size. size. It might be a little bigger. Mm -hmm. 
got uh, Barbara CTO out there, beautiful. Yes, yeah. Glenn's Road King. Mm -hmm. yeah. Is that Jerry's bike? Is that Jerry's bike? That's Jerry's. Yeah, Jerry's. Yeah. One of Jerry's bikes. I know. Jerry's kids. One of Jerry's kids. Really? Look at that. Boom, boom. I think you got this from Marvel Kid. Yeah. <laughs> it's cool. Oh, you got one too. Oh, yeah, nice. That's, that's, my last name is Cross, so. Oh, Cross, okay. Yeah, I like the floorboards, those are pretty cool. Those are nice. Mm, we'll check out. Psycho Fanatics bike here. He's got the 128 Big Boar kit. This thing's a beast. He actually put a new RNS breather. Very nice. Make sure you follow my boy Psycho Fanatics. Right from there. All right, so we're gonna hit the road in a few minutes and uh, heading to um, the market on 9W. All right, guys, we're saddling up. We're getting ready to head out. It's not that cold, so I don't need to wear my um, my heated gear. You know what I mean? So. Who's first? Who's first? Him? Second? You? All right. I'm trying to get the lineup in here. Yo, you third? You third? Third. He's third? Four? Okay. You fifth? I'll be in the back. Okay. We'll do some recording here. All right, let's start going because uh, my battery is on 40% and I'm trying to get some footage up in here. But I think we should be fine. We'll be okay. So we'll see how it holds up. All right, so we got Psycho Fanatics, the other Jerry, Steve, and Dave. Here we go. going nice and easy nothing crazy man we 
rumble, we rumble. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, hell yeah. These potholes in New Jersey, bro. It's freaking crazy. Freaking crazy. This is like deja vu. So when it happened last time, we got into uh, my boy Mike got into an accident over here when we ripped it. Once we make that turn, the problem is that with that turn, it was very, very cold. And uh, what he was doing, he was making a sharp turn, and uh, it was a big, big turn. You know what I mean? So that's, you know, every time I pass through there, I think about it. You know, it's, it's close to my hometown, but. Right here where it happened that's why now when we turn here we actually took a nice slow turn because right here is where it happened the last time we rode together so throughout here mostly is all straight now man these guys are going pretty quick gotta catch up Jerry's bikes keeping up old school Jerry look at that these these bikes are big dogs compared to Jerry's, but he's hanging in there. He's a really cool guy. I've been going to school, high school since with Dave since like middle school and high school. So God damn. We left here at 8 o'clock. Uh, we're only going to 10 o'clock to see what's up. We got Jerry in the building. See if I can try to get on the left side, so uh, so I can get some footage here. This is a good footage of the guys right here.
128 big board kit. This guy is a monster. Make sure you follow him on on uh, Instagram and also on YouTube. Cycle Fanatics. One of my good friends. We became friends actually through uh, Motorcycle World, you know what I mean? So that's pretty cool. Oh yeah. This pipe sound good, man. Pipe sound real good.
Glenn's bike, he has, I think, a, a, a big board kit as well. I mean, he could keep up with John. I mean, it's be a nice race. I'm not really into going really fast, so I'm good with what I have. I don't think I plan on getting anything, you know, done more to my bike, like as far as engine-wise. Um, I'm more of a, like like to cruise and chill, and then you know. But power is power, I guess. Dave's bike right there, looking nice. I like his. I think it's a new helmet. If it is, it looks very nice. No heated gear today. It's not that freezing, so I'm okay. I'm comfortable. I do have hand grip warmers. So, heated, uh, heated bars. guys take off they took off the line like Glenn and Jerry man they're going at it over there holy cow I think as long as you know you're, you're a good shifter you'll be okay as far as you know getting off the line I'm not really good at that like I said I'm not into that but you know some people are that bike man that thing is moving holy cow you also got Glenn right there dope as road king right there man that thing is clean I believe those are D&D &D. love these twisties man these twisties are dope Hopefully one day, man, I could head out to the West Coast. You know, that's always been my sort of dream because I've only been riding for about two years. But uh, I would love to go out there and, and ride in the West Coast. Shit's dope. I'm actually heading out to uh, June 30th. I'll be in uh, Dallas, Texas. Uh, we're riding down to, to Dallas, Texas. We'll be there till um, about two days and then riding back. So if anybody is from Dallas, Texas, I will be there for the Llama National Rally. So and then uh, if you would like to meet up there, um, we could uh, meet up. And get to know each other. You know what I mean? A lot of subscribers are around all over. So if you're in the Dallas, Texas area, June 30th or, or uh, July 1st, I will be there. You'll be seeing, uh, just follow my Instagram, barbercbo 19 and you'll see all the notifications for Dallas, Texas. Hear those pipes.
pipes, baby. Hear those pipes. Alright, we uh we arrived here at the market. We arrived here at the market.
punch that. <laughs> <laughs> how is it on on how fast does it go? Uh, it'll go 80. Max? Yeah. More than that, you're gonna start flying. <laughs> <laughs> so light. <laughs> oh, there he is. How many miles are on your bike? 22. 22 pounds? That's 2007. It's got 17,000 miles on it. Yeah, that means I ride. That's the way I bought it. Mine's only a year and a half old. The guy I bought it from, he didn't ride. He just put chrome and accessories on it. That's all he did. Thank God. Man, this thing looks crazy. It is. It is. It is. It's probably super smooth. Look, yeah. Let me tell you something. This thing has so many accessories. On it, I started taking them off. Oh, oh shit. shit. It had the Curi had the Curiac in hand grips, took them off. It had the Curiac with foot pegs. I, I dropped it, one of them broke, I took it off. It had the Curiac in backrest, I'm not comfortable, I took it off. <laughs> wow. That thing is crazy. It's got a lot of crunk. It's like a it. car. It's got, a lot of light. It's got the, 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 the ring of fire, too, front and back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Very nice. Thank you. Thank you. 2007? Yeah. Very nice. It's clean. You keep it, keep yeah, it good. I keep mm -hmm. it under a cover. Yeah. <laughs> I take it to the car wash. I just polish it. <laughs>